Get my my first hand. Oh. Oh, okay? uh, yeah, the good thing is I got that <laughs> on camera. So. I mean, I'll get through. What makes it harder? What makes it harder? You see that hat, Dave? Oh my gosh, <laughs> what is that? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Are you serious? Oh, whoa, god dang! <laughs> that was a serious shock. <laughs> Oh, thank you. Whoa! <laughs> I meant to help somebody, but I fell in. Hey everyone, thanks for clicking on this video. If you enjoyed that little intro there, stick around for the rest of the journey. A couple of things before we get back into the action. I filmed this as a vlog style video, so if you want to see the entire journey from beginning to end, we try to take you through the experience of what it's like being two middle-aged, non-athlete, average adults trying to attempt something hard in the Tough Mudder 15K. But if you're only interested in the obstacles of the 15k then i've got chapter markers down below that you can click on to take you straight to those obstacles in addition to that you'll see that we do mention some things that we found really helpful for us so if you want to check any of those out i've also got links for those down below thanks again and we do hope that you enjoy this experience as we attempt the tough mutter 15k all right there she is putting on her little shoesies over there <laughs> I'm all geared up. Knees feeling good today. So this adventure may begin before we ever even get out to start running the race. So on the drive here yesterday, now mind you, we drove six hours to get here, right? And on the drive here yesterday, when we were probably about two hours away from here, so we'd, we'd come further than, you know, if we were to just turn around. And mind you, we have a hotel room and all this stuff. Uh, we got an email that said that essentially the rains here have caused, you know, a lot of issues for the for the course. Primarily, you cannot park at the event unless you have a four wheel drive truck. They will not let you in and they've not arranged any other no shuttles, no kind of alternative parking or anything. I don't have a four wheel drive truck. So at this point, we're not totally sure if we're going to be able to run the race or not. But um, even if we do get to run today, it's going to be a very muddy course. Um, so we're going to see. We're going to see what happens. But uh, for now, we don't know. Garmin. All right, so our start time is actually not until nine. It says nine to nine forty-five. Yeah, nine to nine forty-five. It's seven forty-five right now, but we got on the road early to head over here since, like I said, we don't really know what our plan is or how we're going to make this work. So we're hoping by getting over here early. We'll figure something out and, you know, we'll be able to run the race. <laughs> Make our trip actually be worth it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is promising at least. We were able to turn onto the property. Um, so we may not actually be able to, like, park over in the dirt anywhere. But maybe we can park along the road somewhere. And there are other vehicles up here that are trying to figure it out, too. Okay, so a couple things we've learned along the way is now this will be our third Tough Mudder. This kind of rounds out the Tough Mudder because this is the classic or the 15K. And we've run multiple Spartans and everything. So a couple things we learned along the way. We wear Apple Watches 
and uh, I found these cool, they're like all-in-one bands in kind of rubber cases for the actual body of the Apple, Apple Watch. We both have these, they work really well. Um, now I just got the Apple Watch Ultra, so I actually had to buy a new one for the Ultra, um, but these have worked out great. It allows us to record our workout and everything while we're doing it. And then this is a new addition for today's race as well. I found these nice grippy uh, fingerless gloves. They were pretty cheap. I'll put links to all of this stuff. But the other things too is just anti-chafing, right? So uh, we learned that when you're getting all wet or you're sweating or whatever, you chafe a lot. So I've got the squirrel's nut butter. Dawn prefers Vaseline, so she'll put Vaseline everywhere. I use the squirrel's nut butter, I like it. Toes, undercarriage. Um, you don't want chafed those. So, uh, I've actually got these little, these little like, like plastic, like pasties, I guess. Um, they don't have tassels or anything. That'd be nice if they did, but, um, so I put those on. So yeah. So after you've done these a few times, you tear up your hands, you get all chafed up and everything. You just learn a couple things the hard way. So, uh, I think we're ready today. So if you're watching this and you haven't been following, uh, my journey to run a half marathon, run a, oh, that's loud. But uh, if you haven't been following my journey to run a half marathon and now I've been training to run a full marathon, um, I'll link that at some point once that's done. I've been having knee problems. So I ran 15 miles uh, three weeks ago today and it pretty much just wrecked my knee. And I've only had two runs since then. Today, my knee feels pretty good. But this is gonna be the real test, especially running through all these hills and everything. So hopefully, hopefully my knee holds up well and. Uh, you know, this can just be me getting back on track uh, for my training and everything. Okay, so if you just want to see the obstacles that we do, um, I'll put chapter markers down below on those. But I like to document kind of the whole experience for people that are just uh, coming, you know. If you're, if you're thinking about doing one of these obstacle course races, Tough Mudder, whatever. I remember before we ran our first one, I really didn't know what to expect. I was pretty nervous about it. Didn't know what the environment would be like. So, you know, I just kind of want to show that a little bit. Now today's uh, definitely feels different right off the bat. You can see there's a lot less people around um, because of all the weather issues and everything. But, uh, you know, typically you can come and you can make a day of it. Um, so you can, you can run your race, then afterwards they've got food trucks and everything. Um, they normally have some live music. It's a good time, but uh, here in just a little bit, we're gonna get ready to start running the race, and I'll try to document the uh, the obstacles the best I can. Okay, so this is different. You're not gonna tape yours? I don't think I need to. Okay, they're recommending that you tape your shoes on so that your shoes don't come off. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mess around with her stretching. What? Oh. <laughs> that this is my problem, hip flexor. This is my problem, hand stretching. Making our way to the start line. What's so Okay, so first obstacle, lumberjacked. You want to go over first, or you want me? <laughs> I almost landed on the same side. <laughs> Okay, obstacle number two, quagmire. Okay. 
Get your feet That was it. <laughs> 28 more obstacles to go, babe. All right, there's the first mile. And yeah, that's pretty accurate. How you doing back there? Okay. This is treacherous. Oh God. Oh. That is so sweet. Nobody freak out, somebody push him over. <laughs> Obstacle three, mud hole. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. oh. There it is, Tyler. Put your knee further than you think. Here, bear, try to. Go ahead. Oh, thank you. Whoa! <laughs> I meant to help somebody, but I fell in. <laughs> oh. Oh. All right. Okay, man. Oh. 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 oh gosh. Oh crap. There you go. Okay, we're going. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. Holy smoke. <laughs> How muddy are you back there? <laughs> In my hand. Ugh. Another fork in the road. Okay, I think this is the fourth obstacle. Rock hard. It's number four, right? I think so. I think so. All right, go for it, man. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. <laughs> oh, she almost died. Only fell once. It's a wobbly beam. Woo, nice. Should I get a dismount? Beautiful. Number five, cage crawl. Is a harder one easier or easier? Harder or easier? That's what we do. We do hard. Oh, do we? Okay. I do. This one's harder. Harder, yeah, harder and easier. I mean, I'll get. What makes it harder? What makes it harder? The water. Lower. <laughs> You can push up if you need to. Alright, good job. Oh. 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 Oh.
You cannot do that one if you're lost a little bit. You're almost there, babe. Just about a foot more. Whew. That sucked. Yeah, it did. <laughs> Okay, that, that was actually really difficult. Cold water. Yeah. You breathe fast. Well, we went on the hard side, which you did not have much room at all to breathe. There was one point where I had to like lift the chain up some. Yeah, I did too. Whew. There's something ominous looming in the distance. We've never done whatever that obstacle is. All right, I think this is obstacle six. Crybaby. That sounds like a great time. Stay low and move fast. I grabbed your life for All right. Here we go. Well, probably not making for the most exciting video in here. It's just, okay, so this is just like a peppermint mist or something. <laughs> it's really not that bad. Hey, look, your sign says we're clogged up. Uh, yeah. I can't see nothing. <laughs> I was going to like oh, see the light. Oh, crap. Oh. You're in front of me. There's a pole. Hang what on. are you doing? What, what the hell? What? How'd you get in? A... <laughs> you crossed over. I can't see anything. Where are we? Uh, oh. uh, I think over oh, oh, there. Uh, 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 <laughs> looks like we've been doing drugs or something. Banana break. <laughs> How are you feeling? My hamstring hurts. Yeah. Step on my shoulder. Okay. Oh. <laughs> no. You got it? <laughs> it's like, go. <laughs> no. <laughs> it is a lot of time. I'm already here. So I'm <laughs> Oh, thank you. Be careful, it's slippery on the inside. I was like, I was like, oh. <laughs> thank you. I was almost trying, but it was just too slippery. <laughs> Where you at back there? Right here. Where? There you are. Mile three. Obstacle number seven, I believe. Texas Hold'em. You ready for this? You ready for this? You might have got out of last time. We're gonna do good this time, babe. I believe it. Okay. It looks heavy, but it doesn't rock too far. You go as hard down as you can. <laughs> go back further. <laughs> okay, I think I got it. Okay, here you go. Are we supposed to try to transition? I think so. <laughs> <laughs> You're too high. Got it. Got it. Got it. <laughs> it looks like you're way, way, way far behind. All right, number eight, ladder to hell. Now, 
Super easy, baby. Yeah. I feel like I did it like way wrong. Everyone's doing like one leg at a time, and I was just like, yeah. confident. Well, see, now we're up here, and now I'm scared. Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, I guess I picked the tall one. Yeah, you did. Oh well. You You're up there already. <laughs> You got it, dude. You're you got it, babe. Easy. All right, if you follow this guy right here, he'll catch you. So. Yeah. Yeah. Because he's got to record. Yeah. He's got to get yeah, the footage, so I got to catch you. I'm preoccupied. Are you sure? Yeah, I just almost did splits. Good job, babe. Good job. You got it. Good job. Nice. Running up that hill, running up the hill. That's the only part of the words I know. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Thank you. All right, number nine. Stairway to heaven, which is just a great big old mountain. Here, babe, watch me power up this mountain. Okay, I'll ready? just be here. Here we go. Can barely see you out there. Let's go, babe. How do I turn it around? So here I am. Let's go, let's go. Don't die. <laughs> nice. I don't know if this one counts as an obstacle, but I mean, it's just to get around. Yeah. Let's see. It's a bonus. Yeah, I was just going to say, compared to the last one, I'm a little like this. How you feeling? Good. How are you feeling? Liar. So there are little porta potties along the way. Sometimes I won't show you the porta potty, but you gotta do what you gotta do. All right, I think that's number ten. Kiss of mud. Oh, let's go. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Don't snag your junk in the truck. <laughs> that wasn't that bad. <laughs> yeah. Twelve sack up. Thank you. <laughs> 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 
another fence crossing. Oh, you're gonna have to use that little step, probably. I'm gonna try without. Okay. Just for the heck of it. Ew, it's only. So you want me to grab your hand? Uh huh. Oh, not but I don't have a hand again. Oh. Oh. Heck yeah! yeah. <laughs> I'm going <bye. laughs> How did this step help? You guys want the same thing? It just helped me get my my first hand. Oh. Yeah. Oh. 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 The good thing is I got that on camera, so. <laughs> <laughs> Over the shot, yeah. yeah, it was worth it. There you go. I got you. Just put your feet up. There you go. You got it. All right, mile five. 14. Yeah. Hard to get him this guy oh down there okay are you ready yeah okay you want to hold hands I don't know do you I don't, I don't know whatever kind of, all right let's go you ready yeah. let's go <laughs> you see that hat Dave <laughs> Woo. I don't remember what number we're on anymore. So this is just the Black Ness Monster. That was deeper than I was expecting. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, let's see. Oh. Oh. I think I just did the splits to get my leg up here.
Funky Monkey up next. You can do it. You can do it. <laughs> Come on, just give it a shot. It, okay. I have ladder. Okay, I don't I have no idea how I managed to do the funky monkey last time. No, do you did you go up that like that? I don't know. How. I think it was an up one. What? I don't know. But there was like I think it was like just a straight monkey bar. Maybe. Almost passed that up, it fell down. Six miles. And it is like sprinkly out here now. Bail bonds. Woo! <laughs> you want me to go with it? It does look easy for a fat guy, right? <laughs> go for it, babe. Yeah. 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 Oh, go ahead. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> hey, ninja. There you go. <laughs> That's pretty much what I looked like, like that guy over there just floating over everything. Go Ninja! <laughs> there you go, Ben. Parkour! 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 <laughs> okay, so one thing, since we started these, we've worked up to build, really build up our cardio to be able to do these longer distances and training for marathons. One thing I haven't done is worked on my upper body strength at all. So eventually that'll become the goal will be to be able to complete all of these upper body strength obstacles. But for right now, it's just about doing the distance and I feel like a cardio machine right now. Okay, hanging tough. Go for it, babe. <laughs> You gonna go for it? No, you go first. Alright. Is it on? <laughs> if you keep your momentum going, it's a lot easier. Alright. Well, that's good. I've got the girth for a Get that momentum going. And if you so, so you mean keep my momentum yeah, going like forward? Not yeah. Okay. Not right. down. Not back. <laughs> okay. Alright. Gotcha. Hey, I'm tall enough. Oh my god. Hold up. 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 Hold The electric eel. Oh, whoa, God dang. <laughs> that was a serious shock. Oh, man. Oh, God. <laughs> Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. 
Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh man, I'm recharged. Those were the worst shots I have ever taken, even doing the iron cross. Holy smokes! The way we were like running through the water. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was intense. Subway Surfer. This is a new one. No idea what we're doing here. <laughs> you guys down there, y'all might want to just hang for a second. It's getting pretty crowded up here. The descent is slower than the ascent. Get more, more body heat up here, that might be. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I guess we're just going straight down. That kind of freaked me out. Another upper body. One. So this is the hero carry. Where I'm on your back. Yeah. Yeah, I'll tell you. I know what you're talking about. I'll take you back. I'm not gonna make you carry me. Ready? You got me? No. Heavy. <laughs> well swung. Never seen this one before. Huh? Are you gonna try or? Wait. Okay, it's on. I'm not gonna reach that. That's a long ways away. Woo! Oh! oh. <laughs> you want it? You charge it. good, man? Save the hat. Holy crap, that was deep <laughs> and cold. <laughs> this is calm. Tight squeeze. Yeah. Ugh. Gross. I mean, at least, at least, you know, 
you get a super super nice view, you know. Oh, gross. <laughs> Well, I guess I shouldn't go through the middle. <laughs> Holy crap, that is a tight it's, squeeze. That's a little tight. <laughs> Are you serious? Oh, God. Like somebody standing on it. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's toasty. <laughs> I feel like I'm making a <laughs> My butt. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> Are you serious? Well... Good job. <laughs> nice! Oh, gross. Yeah, it's good. Okay, this right here, this is pretty much my Worst nightmare. <laughs> I know, I know. Why would you run obstacle course races if you don't like getting dirty? But, you know. Mile eight. Humped up. Yeah. I am so not good at these. I mean, it seemed like this one wasn't too bad last time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this guy right here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you saw how it's done? It's easy. No, it's not. I'm afraid to fall. Where's the second knot? <laughs> That's how I got it. Do you want to push? Yeah. Sure. Yeah, I got you. Oh. Well let me turn it off at 40 and 41 why do we get out here and do this babe because uh, we can't okay we're still <laughs> capable of doing it. I do it because I like to challenge myself. See, you know, see what I can do. Ooh. And it gives us a weekend away from our kids. <laughs> this is the kind of mud you lose your shoes in. Yeah, this is where everybody's stuck to when they come in. Yeah. Okay, let's see. What is this? Oh, this is a devil's beard. How you doing back there, babe? You coming? Uh, yeah, I just have to move my <laughs> All right. Are you getting caught? That big old dump truck you got or what? No, it's not. Oh. <laughs> Alright, we'll see you at the end of this. Roll. That, that didn't look roll. like that was going to be as hard as it was. It was a little further. Yeah. I was anticipating. Alright, let's just fall down this hill real quick. So, I'm going to go out on a limb and say this is the muddiest stuff mudder yes, we've done. Is. By a long shot and this is some serious mud too it's like nasty. like look at how much it's all caked on too <laughs> like, shoes feel super heavy i think that says mile nine, nine. king of the mountain oh, king of the mountain cowbell Maybe the only cowbell I get today, so I gotta take it while I can. Where you at? Here. Oh. Bell. Oh. On my way down. I feel like I'm gonna like kill myself on this drop. Well, I'll be recording if you do. <laughs> Ok, 
Okay. So next is Everest. <laughs> 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 This is the, uh, so unfortunately, this is the one I'm not even going to attempt this time because last time, I was successful last time, but uh, I hit my knees a lot and I can't afford to risk hitting my, the knee that's been bothering me, that's been injured, I can't afford to uh, risk injuring that. Otherwise, they'll put my whole marathon into jeopardy and everything. And so I'll film a little bit of footage of other people doing it, but I'm not doing it this time. Bye. 